Welcome back to my channel. My name is Heather. I'm a realtor with Real Living Suburban Lifestyle here in the state of Massachusetts. And today I'm gonna to talk to you about the town of Dedham, Massachusetts. So Dedham, Massachusetts is located in Norfolk County and it has a population of about 25,000 people. It is located on Boston's Southwest border and it has seven public schools. So those include one early education center, which is preschool focused. And then there is four elementary schools and then one junior high school and one high school. And all of those schools have been highly rated and have great reviews on all of the websites that you could possibly find to look up schools if you are researching that type of thing before considering making a move to Dedham. Along with their public schools, they also have a few private schools. There is Ursuline Academy, which is an all girls school. It's an independent college academy, college prep, prep academy. Uh, my sister actually went there, so I know a little bit about that one. That was just for grades seven through 12. And then they also have Noble and Greeno, which is a co-ed um, day and boarding school. And that is also for grades seven through 12. And if you were looking to do a private school for the earlier ages, they have the Dedham Country Day School, which does pre-K up until eighth grade. So there are a bunch of different options for the schools in, in Dedham, but whether you go private school or public school, they're all very highly rated. So the next thing I'm gonna talk about is transportation, because that's a huge thing whenever you're thinking about moving anywhere. So in Dedham, there are two commuter rails, and within both of them, I would say it's probably about a 30 minute commuter rail trip, commuter rail train ride, <laughs> whatever you wanna call it, um, into the city, just with all the stops. And then if you were to just commute on your own in the car, it's about 30 minutes depending on traffic. So either way, it's, it's not bad. Um, certainly a great spot to be if you are thinking of working in the city and wanting to live in the suburbs. It, it's not a bad commute at all. I think for me the attractions in Dedham are my most favorite because I think Dedham has a lot of history and there's just a lot of really awesome things that Dedham has to offer. Some of my favorite attractions in Dedham, um, so there is the, um, well I'm just going to go with my personal favorite which is the mini golf, <laughs> golf mini golf. I went there all the time when I was a little kid and um, it's just a fun spot. They also are well known for having Legacy Place. Which Legacy Place, you can find a amazing movie theater. Prior to Legacy Place, there was the old school movie theater there that I used to go to when I was younger, but they um, replaced that with Legacy Place. It's an outdoor shopping center and it's honestly, there's so many awesome shops and great restaurants. Really great spot to go if you are thinking about moving to the Dedham area. Some of the other attractions that you definitely would want to visit if you were thinking about moving to Dedham or just even visiting Dedham or living in Dedham are the Fairbanks House. It is a historic museum and it is the oldest timber frame house in New England and they offer tours of their of their home so definitely go and check that out and uh, Dedham Community Theater which aside from the movie theater at Legacy Place it's a more small key theater there I believe that there was only ever two showings at one time so it was very low-key Um, they would pop the popcorn old-school style um, some of my favorite restaurants uh, in Dedham if you like sushi you have to go to Bamboo and you have to have the Celtic Maki. Celtic Maki at Bamboo is the best. If you like Italian food, then the Brick House Cafe is definitely a spot to check out. Some of my other favorites are, uh, I mean, honestly, all the restaurants at Legacy Place are really good. P.F. Chang's is really great. Yard House is really good. Um, Legal Sea Bar is really good. Uh, Shake Shack, can't go around with the burgers. And so that is it for me today. I'm gonna do another tour of what's for sale in Dedham later this week. So you can kind of get an idea of what cost of living in Dedham would be like and what you would get in the neighborhoods that have homes for sale. So I hope everyone had a great week and thank you so much for watching.